What's up guys, Adam C here for Hidden Jackpots and I am in Cuba. That's right, KO Santa Maria and I am at the Grand Aston KO Las Brujas Resort and Spa. Let's go check out my room. So check-in went really smoothly and uh, everyone's super friendly here, which is very cool. And we were actually checked in a little bit earlier. Our room, the room was ready. So it's our room, 0548. Let's check it out. All right, here we are in the room. The door's a little bit hard to close. So one thing you will notice is yes, I have already been in this room. There is stuff around, but everything's not unpacked yet. So it's not super messy. So let's start out right here. I do have an ocean view and this is not the ocean view. We have this giant door, which you can see here. Let's check it out. I believe it's probably going to be a closet. Yes, there we are. We have some hangers, the iron, the ironing board. What do we have up there? Oh, it looks like another comforter. I don't know if we're gonna need a comforter, but there's quite a bit of closet space here. The safe. Got some drawers, which I will be utilizing because I will be here for seven days. Oh, that door is heavy. Let's close that. Take a look what we have over here. Nice little spot for your luggage. Some more storage and the fridge. There it is, nice little mini fridge. What's in it? Oh! Oh, oh so two things of wine. That wine, let me point out, did not come with the room. It's a big bottle of water, which we'll not be drinking. I'm gonna be using that for brushing our teeth. Close this, see what else we got. We'll take a look, let's do the bathroom. So, out here, hello, that's me. It's so hot, I'm so happy I finally had a chance to change. From the airport to hit this resort was an hour and 45 minute drive. It was a long drive. Luckily I sat nice, next to this awesome guy who knew a lot about Cuba. He's from Miami and he's a Canadian, but he lives in Miami actually. And he is from Canada, so he's allowed to travel to Cuba. And he's been here over 52 times, so he had a lot of information for me, which was very cool. So here's our sink. We've got the toiletries here. Grand Aston toiletries. I think uh, right here may have been a mirror. Can you see me? No, because there's no mirror. And one thing you're going to know about, like you need to know about Cuba, is uh, there's a lot of shortages and stuff. So, you know, just be prepared for that. Our mirror is nice though. Let's check out the water. No, I've read some complaints about no water pressure. Let's see what we got. Oh, there's no water. No water. Okay, we'll have to check into that. Now here's the bathroom. The one thing I love about this room it's like the barn doors, not barn doors, but the, you know, the sliding doors. I do like these sliding doors. So we got that. There's the shower. There's no bathtub, which is fine with me. Nice shower. It's got the handheld wand, the rain head up there. There is toilet paper, two rolls, which is nice. The toilet's right there. Let's see, hopefully if there's no water. Oh, come on, man. All right, so here's the shower. I'm going to say that the shower probably won't turn on. With my luck, it will, because I just stepped into the shower. But no, no water. No water in the shower, no water in the toilet. Holy moly. All right, oh, this, look at that bed. That bed is huge. Huge. Got two beach towels, nice pillows, some lamps. 
So we've got an outlet here, which I believe you can use, hopefully, because I need to charge my stuff. Little work area if you're gonna work, TV. Oh, what's that? Look at that. That's my cup for the week. Certified hidden jackpots. Nice full length mirror. That's a tall mirror. Floor to ceiling mirror. Hello, it's me again. <laughs> we got over here, this is where stuff is. I apologize for the mess here. We got a little uh, coffee maker, two cups, a spoon. This I believe is where you would put sugar if there was sugar. Uh, there's no coffee, so maybe make sure you bring your coffee. And over here is the other table with another outlet. So that's good. There's at least a couple outlets. Telephone, which I will be probably using to check if we can get some water pressure. There's another outlet. It says 220 volt. I got my charger plugged in there. So I have an ocean view, ocean view room here. And I want to take you guys out. But the music is so loud. You guys can probably hear it. Maybe I'll take you out anyway. That's the view. Let's get this room open. Oh, oh my God. I need to start lifting weights to freaking lift that door open. That is a heavy door, heavy. Hopefully you guys can't hear the music. But there we are. I am on the fifth floor. That's my ocean view. Hopefully you guys can see it. There's a lot of bush there. I still haven't been to the beach, but that's how close I am to the main pool and the family section, because there is an adult section here. And, uh, oh, maybe that's an outdoor light here. That would be pretty sweet if there's an outdoor light. So uh, hopefully there is, and maybe I'll chill out on the balcony later. I'm gonna leave the screen open at night because there is an amazing breeze that blows in. Oh, boy. sorry. Oh, I need to use all my weight to close that door. Sorry, but that's the, uh, that's the view of the room from here. This chair is actually pretty comfortable. So yeah, that's the room. If you like this room tour from Grand, Aston, Cayo, Las Brujas, Resort and Spa. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up and a like. Let me know what you think, would you stay here? I know there is some uh, little flaws here and there, but again, remember, I am in Cuba. And again, make sure you like, subscribe and share. So on that note, I'm gonna call and see about my water. And I will see you in the next video. Ciao.